Hey, what's up, guys? This is your big homie, Big Mike, checking in Real Talk TV. Hope you guys are having a great day, and thanks for tuning in to the video. I appreciate it, all right? So this morning, I had a realization, man. You know, as I was sitting here, you know, doing my meditation, morning meditation, and uh, something I want to share with you guys. You know, when it comes to the subject of friends and that term, uh, friends, a lot of us think we have friends, and indeed you may. You may have friends. But one thing I've learned throughout my life, as my grandmother told me, my grandmother told me when I was young, that boy, you don't have any friends. I used to say, Grandma, my friends, I want to hang out with my friends. She'd be like, boy, you don't got no friends. And now I get it. Now that I'm older, I get it. As we go through this journey called life, man, we have, you know, we, we may have friends in certain stages. But a friend, a true friend that sticks with you for a lifetime, that is rare. Because as you go through life, man, people are going to change. You're going to change. Your interests are going to change. Your passions are going to change. And, you know, life circumstances, you know, you may get married and blase, blase. And so as you go through life, man, to have a friend that's with you through every stage of life, that is very, very uncommon. That's not, that's, that's rare. Through elementary school, middle school, high school, into adulthood, you got families and you're still friends. I mean, you don't really find that. And so what I, what I understand about life is that you have friends at certain stages. Like I had friends when I was young at a certain stage, then I got older, you know, uh, got a new circle of friends. Then I got even older, <laughs> Got a new circle of friends as I traveled the world and they, you know, did things like that. And all relationships are going to dissipate. So that's a fact of life, man. As you go through life, your circles, your circles are going to change. And so when it comes to friends, I look at it down like these are people that I'm sharing my time with, but I'm very careful who I call my friend. Because a friend is not a friend until they prove it. I don't care what nobody say. Like, I don't care about you calling me your friend. Eh, whatever. I want to see actions. And so that's what you got to see. And um, as I said, man, to go through this life and have a friend with you through every stage of life, that's a blessing indeed. And what you'll come to find out as you go through life, you're not going to have you're not going to have a lot of people like that. Point blank, period. So I get what she says now, because as she got older, she didn't have really any friends. She, you know, she had maybe one, I think, but. She didn't have like a lot of friends because like she said, as you go, as you go through life, people are going to drop off. It's like life is like catching public transportation. Anybody ever been on a city bus? You know what I'm talking about. At the beginning of your journey, you have all these people on the bus, you know what I'm saying, that you riding with and having conversations with. And then as the bus journey continues, people are going to start drop, you know, they're going to fall off because people got to get off at their stop. Right. And so by the time you get off, the same amount of people that you had at the beginning of the ride may be a lot slacker as you get off, you know, as you get to your destination. It's not going to be as many people as you get to your destination, right? So that's like, that's like life. People are going to drop off in different, you know, at different stops, different bus stops. And so, but you got to appreciate them while they're here, while you have them, you know what I'm saying? Just appreciate the time. But as you go through life, you will come to, real, you come to realize real quick, you really don't have the friends you thought. And then there's even those who do you dirty, that's not, forget that. There's people who do you dirty too. You know what I'm saying? As you go through life, it's like, dang, really? People cheat with people's boyfriends and all types of stuff, man. Friend, friends are dirty, man. Like some friends can be dirty. I'll put it that way. But appreciate people while you got them. And also look at what, how you benefited from that relationship. That's one thing I look at too. I look at how did I, how did this person benefit me while they were in my circle? Because there's people that you can learn from, and even though y'all may not be friends still, you might have that's you may have something that you learn from them that you're still using today. Like there's a lot that I learned from my old best friend. Like me and her ain't best friends anymore, but from that relationship, I gained a lot. I wouldn't even be where I'm at today if it wasn't for that friendship at that time. So I'm very thankful, you know, for having somebody in my life for almost 30 years that I can call my friend at that time. But as I said, I got older, he got older, things changed, feelings changed, we went our separate ways. But I still love him. I still love him dearly because, like I said, if it wasn't for him, I wouldn't be the person I am. He helped shape who I am today by having somebody in my life that, you know, for that long. So, 
But I'm not bitter about it. And don't be bitter about that. Don't be bitter about people no longer being in your life, man. That's life. That is life. People are going to be there for a while and then they're going to be gone. You know, and even those who stay with you for a long time, eventually everybody's going to leave you, man. Everybody's going to leave at some point. Even if it's by death, some people are going to leave. You know, so enjoy people while you have them and stop getting so, you know, stop putting that, 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 throwing that term friend out there, you know, so, so loosely, you know, because you really don't have the friends you think you do. And life will show you that. But anyway, that's all I got on my rant. <laughs> Just wanted to get that off my chest to you guys, man, and wanted to show some uh, love and, um, yeah, give you guys an encouraging word this morning, uh, if that you call that encouraging. But <laughs> it's just true. <laughs> but anyway, man, I'm going to finish my green juice. You know what I'm saying? Health is wealth. You guys take care. Be blessed, man. I love y'all. Until next time, Big Homie Big Mike checking out, man. Peace.